Hello. Um. Welcome to day 890. <coughs> and Happy New Year. I'm um, still alive. I'm not getting any better. My name is Stephanie Grow. Um, as you already know or may not know, um, um, I don't do a lot of preparation for the videos. I, um, I mean, there's a lot of computer work that goes into it. I, um, I have a camera that I'm shooting with that has a video mode, and um, I haven't started a timer yet, so maybe I should start a timer. Um, but this is going to be a short video, so um, maybe I won't start a timer. I'll just start one. Okay. Um, oh. It's been two weeks. Um, I've been trying to uh, catch up on some other things. I'm a drummer. I play jazz drums. Um, you could say that if I'm playing drums, then maybe I, I don't hurt that bad, but um, I sit down very carefully when I play. Um, uh, drums is really something I enjoy. Uh, I um, if I if I die prematurely, I, I want I, I want to at least enjoy what I have left um, on this earth. Um, so that that would be my answer to that. I I really enjoy the drums and um, I withstand a lot of pain sitting to play the drums. Um, so uh, having said that. Um, I haven't started a timer, so I'm just going to make it a short video. Um, this is in the morning, so I can't do it in my trailer, and I'm kind of tired. I'm kind of tired. Um... So anyways, I shoot the videos with a camera. Uh, they are saved in AVI format. I take the card out. I stick it into my laptop card reader. And I um, pull the file off of the card onto a external drive. Um, external hard drive. It looks like this. It looks just like this. I have two. Um, when I have a laptop that crashes, I put this, um, put a hard drive in here and I, I can still access my files, so, um, I'm pretty, um, technologically savvy, um, I mean, if you wanted to compare me to the average person, but that's just because of my, um, my background and my, my, uh, career, so, uh, it's eight. It's day eight hundred and ninety. Um, post complications. Um, uh, I'm sorry. Day eight hundred and ninety uh, of sex change sabotage by Dr. Suporn Watanyu Sakal of Chanburi, Thailand. And today, I um, I uh, I'm. It was two weeks. I in the two weeks I was um, um, busy, and yesterday or um, yeah, yesterday evening I I was able to get some videos up onto a secure website. Uh, the The website is Live Links uh, or Live Leaks uh, dot com. I think it might be dot org. But I put a link um, down in the um, 
uh, in the link section. Uh, I was going to put, the, uh, th these are photos, photographs of um, my uh, groin or my neo-vagina. Um, neo uh, is a word used to differentiate um, a transsexual's vagina versus a genetic woman's vagina. Um, uh, so I use neo vagina just to be accurate. Um, so um, I have photos uh, at the links and um, the photos are trying to show, I have many photos on my hard drive that I've taken over the last two years and so these photos were taken at um, various times in the early part of my complications or my sex change sabotage. Um, I'd rather say sabotage because it's more um, more specific. Um, complication is, you know, it, it's considered as a complication, but because um, because the nature complication and the intent behind it, um, I believe it's more than a complication. A complication is something that you know happens once and you um, get it resolved somehow. It doesn't keep getting worse, and so um, I'm getting worse. I I believe I was injected with uh, embalming fluid. I believe that the embalming fluid is oil based, and I believe it's uh, continuing to um, to uh, provide toxicity in my groin, continuing to spread, and continuing to um, embalm further fluids or further uh, tissues. So. Um, so, um, what time is it? Okay, so, so these are photos, four photos that I picked out because, um, while I'm taking my photos at the time, I'm not thinking about why I'm taking the photos. I'm just taking a bunch of photos. So I've taken hundreds of photos every day up to about, you know, six months post-op, and then I went to it once or twice a day, and then you know, you, you peter off after a while, but um, I had to search all the photos to find ones that, sh that showed uh, sutures, um, and I believe these photos will show uh, sutures that are dissolvable sutures that did not dissolve after 106 days, that's 15 weeks, and if you do research on the web, you'll, you'll see that sutures... Um, uh, dissolve much sooner than 15 weeks, uh, six weeks on average, and uh, 12 weeks, 12 weeks um, tops. So uh, the, these are uh, sutures. Um, I believe the the sutures that are not dissolving, I, or me showing that the sutures are not dissolving, um, uh, are, is indicative of of a wound that is embalmed, has no uh, fluids uh, entering or, or leaving this wound, this neo-vagina. This, it's a wound because it, it was uh, exposed to the toxin during um, day, the, the, uh, the wound recovery, uh, day nine post-op, which is uh, considered a wound and it's, it's not functional vagina. It's, so it's, um, uh, uh, there's no, um, because there's no um, fluids uh, or chemical processes happening in, in this embalmed tissue, then there's no suture suture uh, sutures dissolving or being absorbed by the body. <clears throat> so um, I um, that's all I have to say. I, you can that's the first um, that's the first uh, bit of evidence. Um, that, I, that I'm going to put together. I'm going to put, um, I believe the photos also show d tissue deterioration and, and a, ure a, a urethra that's uh, about the size of a quarter in diameter. Um, so there's other things in the video, in the photos on live leaks. Uh, I put the links here. Uh, and, um, it feels better that we've gotten through the first series of videos. 
I did read some of your comments. Uh, some of them, if you're going to call me crazy, uh, specify why, be more specific. I believe that there's people out there that can't be specific because they aren't trying to be, uh, they're tr not trying to have a productive conversation, they're trying to derail what I'm trying to say and and my story. There's people out there that don't want my story out and that's, that's not going to work. Um, I am not going to send pictures to people privately either. It's going to be all public. Um, I, if someone has any idea on how to copyright, copyright a, um, uh, you know, photographs, how to put a copyright on those, you know, in the image, uh, you could help me, uh, you give me some ideas for that. I, I, um, would be interested in, in putting a copyright on my photos. The, the ones that I uploaded were resized from their original format, so if someone tries to uh, edit the fit the photo the the photo the the video the 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 photo if they try to edit the photo then um, then I'll have the original that's uh, has um, uh, much more um, MPEGs or much more resolution. So um, um, that's all I have right now. If I plan on finding some more videos of sutures that go past 15 weeks. Um, the reason I stopped at 15 weeks looking is because I remember in late uh, 2009, early 2010, these the sutures that were remaining were removed by my gynecologist at the time. Uh, after some amount of persistence on his part, he was obviously trying to cover his butt, um, and he these doctors know what they're doing. Um, even though it's a, a doctor of the United States, uh, I had to convince him that I, I did not want him to do anything to the, uh, to the area uh, until six months were up. And basically, I was quoting uh, what Dr. Suporn had told me. So uh, it was very easy to convince the doctor not to remove uh, sutures uh, until I was ready for him to remove sutures. So uh, these sutures that he removed were external, were, were not sutures deep inside the wound, they were sutures um, in the in the labia or sutures in the um, uh, clitoris area. Uh, readily visible and not something that was um, providing any um, uh, complicated wound closure. Uh, at least not at 15 weeks um, post-surgery. So, um, um, okay, so I'm going to let you guys have that, and that's the first first piece of evidence. Uh, it is a bulleted item on the, the, uh, the whiteboards that I put up, the outline, and it shows um, embalmed. It, it, it's it's uh, very important piece of evidence pointing to embalmed tissue so um, uh, tissue absorption will be next I'll show tissue um, deterioration and absorption okay um, I didn't put a timer on but I believe that's 15 minutes I should have because I feel like I'm running out of time it feels like um, time flies by that you can get a video in in a short amount of time but it takes much longer to um, actually do a video and um, I appreciate you guys um, subscribing and um, tell your friends and tell tell the world what uh, what's going on with me so that I can get help I'm still waiting for help for somebody um, and uh, I promise to uh, put a PayPal link uh, somewhere that you can uh, click on if you want to send me money okay uh, this is not a financial quest. I, I do need money if I want to um, get things done, like get some tests done to uh, or, or hire a lawyer or there's a lot of things or, or, or move out of my my truck uh, into an apartment. Um, I, money would be uh, something that would, um, would help me um, 
it would help me tremendously. So um, it would it would it would give me more time if I didn't have to work. I could I could spend more time on this. I am looking for work, uh, even though it's hard for me to sit at a desk. And I uh, I work as a software engineer, so um, I I did get some replies from recruiters this week and and contemplate getting an offer sometime in early this year January hopefully so um, okay I I know that I have plenty of time left but I'm going to um, end this video I don't even know if it's recording um, if it's not recording I'm gonna be pissed so let me check to see if it's recording okay okay it's recording so um, it wasn't a waste of time there's no light on the front of the camera that says it's recording I just have to use my timer and make sure the card is empty before I stick it in the camera so um, my name is Stephanie Grow. this is a day 890 of sex change sabotage by Dr. Suporn with Tanya Sackle um, have a good day